this is a quick guide to using the game day registration system and it will show clubs how to register their players put them into teams and also register members and coaches and link them to their teams each club will have an admin who is responsible for sending members registration forms and adding those members into their respective teams to be able to do this Admins will first need to register a passport. To do this, go to passport.mygameday.app. Go to the register tab. Fill in your details and click create my passport. Once you have created a passport, please email me at registration at harbour.basketball. I will then be able to give you access to your club. Please ensure you mention the club or school you would like to be admin for in the email. You can have multiple admins of your club. Each person will need to complete this process to become an admin. When I've given you access, you should be able to log in. You'll be taken to this screen. Click Memberships and Competition Management. And your club will show up on the left here. My club is called Test Club. You are now at the home screen of your club. The next step is to get your players to register into your club. You can do this by sending them the registration link that I should have sent you. If you cannot find that, you can find your link by going to registrations, registration forms, scroll down, club registration forms, click view. Here's the registration form for your club. Simply copy and paste this link and send it to your members to register to. Any coaches or managers will have the option to click that they are registering as a coach or manager when they fill in this form. Same with players, they should click player. Once they have completed the registration form, they should be registered into your club. Just a quick tip on Chrome, you can easily create a QR code by going to share create QR code and downloading this image. Uh, this will be handy for registration days at school where players or parents can scan this image with their phone and they'll be taken straight to your club registration form. If you come back to this page and go to members, list members, you'll be able to see all the members registered to your club. Next, you'll want to add these members into the team they are playing for. To do this, go to Teams. Select the team you want to add the members to. I'll select the basketball team. You can see here I'm working within the basketball team instead of Test Club. So I want to go to the member list of the basketball team. So far, there's no one registered. We want to go to modify member list and here you'll see available players who are registered in the test club and here you'll see the players who have been moved into the team. All we need to do to move them into the team is press the add button, press the add button. Now these two players are registered. If you've made a mistake you can simply take away and add someone in. Make sure you press save team selection. OK. Now if we return to the team member list, those two players are registered. Next you will need to add your players playing numbers. To do that you want to click under the team number column and add the number. Click enter and it should highlight green. When you get to the bottom row, add their number, clicking enter will not save it. You'll need to click on the cell next to it and this will save their number. Once you have completed all your team's playing numbers, next we'll need to add team coaches. Do this by going to members, team staff, coach and scroll through the coaches and you should find those who have registered as coaches. You can do the same for managers or assistant coaches. 
save. Once saved on here, players' information will automatically be pulled to Glory League. If they are not registered in their team on game day, they will not show on Glory League. I'll quickly run through this process again. Teams. Find the team you want to add players to. Members, list members. Modify member list. Here you can see certain filters, if you want to filter by gender, age, you can do that. Um, or you can click here to show only unassigned players. So the two players who are registered in the old team do not show up here. Add players, save, OK. Go back to the team list, add the playing numbers, 45, enter. 66. Click here to save the last one and now that's all done. Now to do the team staff, coach, select coach, manager, same person. Save and now that should all be done.